In this tutorial video, I want to talk about a concept called 16 levels. Now, 16 levels is a concept in machine whereby one sound can basically be transposed not by pitch, but actually by velocity. So, for instance, velocity is how hard or soft I hit a sound. And you can see here in the software, the velocity settings, you'll see as it records, you're going to see, depending how hard I hit it, you're going to see a level correspond to the sequence note. Same as like any, any DAW or anything like that. So what 16 levels means is if I take this snare, I can actually go ahead and put it in 16 level velocity. Simply come to the keyboard and you will see the tab for 16 levels. So now, No matter how hard I hit, this is always going to come in at full, and this is always going to come in at the bottom, and everything else is in between. So I'm only playing the hi-hat, but I'm playing it at different velocities without having to use my finger to judge how hard or soft it's going to be. I know this is always going to be full on, and this is going to be low. So you can see you can get a more realistic sound. It's very, very good for like hi-hats or any kind of sound like that, but really works on any single sound when you don't want such a static response. So for instance, you also have an option for fixed velocity. So if I have fixed and I have the setting, for instance, here at 127, this is always going to come in again, no matter how hard or soft, it's always just going to come in like that. So if we record, We see just how loud that comes in and how <laughs> fake, how machine-like it actually sounds. Not machine in a good way, but like a robotic machine. So let's delete that pattern. And let's create a new one where, let's start with the hi-hat. What we're going to do is put this on 16 level and we'll record it in. Totally messed that up. Let's clear it out. Just my tempo. Perfect. And you can see each velocity lighting up differently on the pads, and you can see where they came in here. And of course, you can adjust these if you like. You know. But that's the key to 16 velocity here. So when we turn it on, make sure you're selected on a specific sound. So let's do it for a kick. Once that's highlighted, I can come into 16 level. Let's record. And you can leave it recording. We can come out now. We can hit the snare. You get the idea. Works very well for every single kind of sound, especially, you know, maybe something like a triangle. You're hitting the same thing, but you want a more dynamic response.